going on, Legion? As we're going to like always, we got Star Wars, Rise of the Skywalker. Uh, I don't know if that means that we're going to see Rey's a Skywalker or, or what's going on. Is she going to really be like the twin to Kylo Ren like I thought or not? I, who knows? New character, I'm not sure. I haven't seen or heard anything about this. Uh, I am a little late on this trailer, so if you do check it out, I appreciate it. Please like and share it if you like the reaction. Um, yeah, man, there's just a lot of stuff that came out, man, whether it's Endgame, Game of Thrones, and Star Wars. All the, the trifecta of things I like. Let's just get into it, check it out, see what it's all about. Oh, please, dear baby Jesus God, let's hope it's good. Please don't be a disappointment. All right, Ray, what's up? Ooh, I, I have the lightsaber. She got it. The Luke. The Veda. We've passed on all we know. Yeah. Of course. A thousand generations live in you now. TIE Fighter. A solid this is thing. your fight. <laughs> uh, I laugh it wasn't her though. That looks like a Vader X Wing almost, but it's not. Oh, wait, is that Kylo Ren's? I bet you, are they just training? Please tell me they're training. I just hear Palpatine in the goddamn movie. Why? Why was Palpatine's laugh in the movie? Why why was Palpatine's laugh in the movie? Can you tell me? I don't understand. Why? That huh. That's a that's a legitimate goosebumps. I my face doesn't know how to convey what I'm feeling inside. Huh. Huh huh huh. Now for anybody that's been here for any amount of time, you know that I'm not the fan of Rey. I just don't like her character. Um, I, I, I just never have. She was never my favorite, and I, I kind of didn't like the writing. It's not that I didn't like the Rey character. I didn't like the writing that went in to Rey. Because um, she it, it was like a bad anime. She went from being nothing to all of a sudden super badass. So... Oh my god, we just saw fucking, uh, uh, oh, damn it, what the, we just fucking saw the original, damn it, what the Generation fuck's his name? Now. The original, uh, Millennium Fal Falcon this owner, is your find. Lando, we just saw Lando, that's crazy. Is that why he was, they, they did the, uh, um... The movie they did, uh... Yeah, they did. That could be Kylo Ren. Oh, it's red like his mask, it looks like. I just want to say, is... Is Snoke really Emperor, Emperor Palpatine and never died? Or is it his clone? Or is it something else? It, it was just healing? Is that what's really going on? I'm, I'm curious. Huh. Are we going to see, like, a Vader come back? It wasn't Rogue One, I don't believe. What was the, um... Shit, I can't think... Or maybe it was Rogue One. What's the one with uh, Amelia Clark? 
Oh, that was the Han Solo. Is that why they did the Han? That's why they did the Han Solo movie. To, excuse me, for Lando Calrissian by uh, Glover, Danny Glover, or whatever the hell his name is. And now they brought him back into this. So he looks like he's either still evil or he's just doing his own thing. <laughs> That's too damn cool. The saga comes to an end. I didn't see that last time. Oh shit, fucking jetpack troopers. We'll always be with you. <laughs> December. Now I understand what that meant. I understand what that meant. You know, they definitely they covered it up. They covered it up real good. They said no one's ever truly gone. As Mark Hamill, Luke Skywalker says that, you're like, oh yeah, 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 he's not gone. And then you hear the laugh, and it just takes you, it took me completely off guard. I didn't realize what was going on. I watched it a second time. Luke says that Emperor, Emperor Palpatine, Darth Sidious, isn't really gone. Dude, this would be, I, I would be, I am hyped. I'm extremely hyped. I feel like the first two movies that came out, um, seven and eight were in a way lackluster I guess like they were good entertainment wise but the story maybe it's because they left out so much like they were decent movies I think in an action kind of way um but I kind of wanted more of the story revealed uh at least put something else in there that gave us some real story it was literally two cliffhangers in a row and I just was not a fan of that. It made me not like those movies that much. Um, and, you know, I think I've watched, just because I've wanted Star Wars stuff to watch, I've watched uh, episode three and, and some, somewhat of two, but I can kind of watch uh, a handful of Star Wars movies over and over and over again. It's not hard. Um, General Grievous makes three Real easy to watch. Because he's one of my favorite characters. I've watched Star Wars, The Clone Wars, the animated series, the whole thing, about six times. Full on watched it. Because um, that's how much I like Star Wars. I just wanted something Star Wars to watch, you know? And it's not so it's not that hard to re-watch Star Wars stuff. But those last two movies were just like... They were heavy on the world and lore building to kind of say this is what's going on. And we got two of those movies. And now we're going to get one movie that's supposed to be like really badass. And the time, you know, maybe in the time I was just like, as of right now, I'm like, eh, I don't really like seven or eight. Um, but after I see nine, I'm going to be like, all right, here's the full picture. The other two movies make a lot more sense now. I doubt that'll happen for me. Um,. But I'm really, it comes to an end. We should get all the reveals. There shouldn't be any kind of like spinoffs or anything like that that's going to get more information later on down the road. That is just super just greedy on Disney's part. They do that uh, to, you know, to make more money by just feathering, uh, you know, kind of spacing out all the stuff through animated series and stuff like that. I want to know Ray and Kylo and. And all the other lore and, and Snoke and Palpatine now and possibly Vader and Luke. I want all that stuff revealed in this movie, 100%. I don't want a spinoff to tell me. I don't want a cartoon to tell me. I'm hoping that's what it is. Now with that, I'm going to get out of here. But I will be saying that there is a Star Wars Jedi Fallen Order video game. That might be good. The, the CGI, the special effects, the graphics in that game look, look top tier. It looks like it's better then Battlefront for sure. And I'm really excited to check that out, so stay tuned for that. And uh, again, if you liked what you saw, you liked what you uh, were checking out here, you can leave a comment down below discussing anything we talk about, whether it's on this video or anything else we discuss on this channel. If you do like, you can always like, subscribe, or share. Remember, it's completely up to you. I do appreciate it, though. 
it does help me out in some way or another. And I'll see whatever video I'm doing next. I'm like just, I'm kind of scatterbrained in a way. Like I just, I, I can't even do like my outro correctly because I'm so th just thinking about what's going to be going on in this movie. I'm going to go watch a lot of the other reactors. Um, check out this trailer now. I I was away from it for a while. There's a few of them I want to check out specifically. It's going to be kind of fun. I can't wait to see them flip. It's really early in the morning, so I couldn't be too loud. I know my laugh probably woke some people up, but um, I couldn't get all kinds of crazy. But I am pretty excited. I also just woke up. So with that, thanks for, again for watching, and I'll see you on that video game if you come back. If not, thanks for stopping by. Later.